After the first quarter of Washington State and Wyoming, were you looking around and thinking, this again? Cowboys scoring twice in the opening frame, but in the final three quarters, a goose egg. Sarah Wheeler has more from Pullman on the Cougs' defensive turnaround. Well, certainly not the prettiest game here, but hey, a win's a win, especially here at Martin Stadium. The last time the Cougs did that over a year ago on September 13th of last fall, that game against Portland State. The first half of this thing, though, didn't look promising for the Cougs. They led by only a score at the break in the second half. The defense really came to life, and the guys say they took notice. You know, it wasn't so much logistical uh, adjustment. It was just the fact that, you know, that they, they came out the first half and wanted it more than we did, and we played down to their, their level and didn't respect them. And, and uh, that second half, it, we, we came out and uh, played, played Cougar D, like, like we know how, execute and um, play with effort and play together. That was a huge problem for us in the first half was uh, leverage, and Grinch came in uh, pretty mad about that and uh, fixed that, came out second half, played hard, kept our leverage, knew our assignments, played fast. I would say the effort, like people were running to the ball, doing their assignment, be where they're, where they're supposed to be. Like everybody play their play out today. It was a heck of a uh, second half. So with that, when Washington State improving to two and one on the year, they're above 500. The best news though, these guys get next week off. It's a bye week, plenty of time to rest and plenty of time to improve. Plus two weeks to prep for Cal in the beginning of Pac-12 conference play. Pointing with the Cougs in Pullman, I'm Sarah Wheeler, KXOY4 Sports.